race to represent New York's 21st congressional district, Elise Stefanik, came out on top. Her victory has put the young Republican in the national spotlight. WPTZ's Allison Carey is live now with more on that. Allison. Steph, over a year ago, a Bush White House aide from the North Country began posturing for a first-time run for office. Last night, the voters of New York's 21st congressional district made her candidacy, which had already attracted national attention. One for the record books. We made history tonight. Thank you again. God bless you. God bless the North Country. And may God bless the United States of America. Have fun tonight. In a race that has garnered national attention, Republican candidate Elise Stefanik became the youngest woman ever elected to Congress. The 30-year-old Republican will represent New York's 21st congressional district. It's very exciting. It's a humbling experience. My number one focus is representing the constituents of this district. But I hope the historic nature of this candidacy, I hope it encourages more young women to step up to the plate and run for office, regardless of party affiliation. In an emotional victory speech, Stefanik thanked her family, supporters, and her opponents, Democrat Aaron Wolf and Green Party candidate Matt Funicello, for a hard-fought brave. Despite the three-way race, Stefanik received a majority of the vote, totaling about 53 percent. Well, Stefanik won easily, so consequently that had no impact. Uh, you, you total out, you know, you know the, the Green candidates votes with Wolf's, and uh, she still wins. Uh, she's going to be a celebrity. She's attractive. She's young. The, you know, going to be the youngest member of the House, uh, youngest woman ever elected. So she will be. Uh, she'll be a celebrity. You know, she, you know, let's hope she doesn't get stars in her eyes. Amid the attention, Stefanik says she will stay true to her North Country roots. I really love my parents and my family, and they've raised me with very strong values and a determination that I think helps carry me through this campaign. But what's most important today is if you look around this room, the hundreds of supporters who turned out from all corners of this district, it's just a tremendously humbling process, and I'm so honored to have earned the support of the voters. The formerly youngest elected congresswoman also represented New York. That was Democrat Elizabeth Holtzman. She was 31 when she was elected to Congress in 1973. I'm Allison Carey, WPTZ News Channel 5. Allison, thank you.